Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna kind of be doing a what's in my backpack video. So I got a new backpack and I was looking on YouTube to see what other people pack in their backpack and you know what am I missing from mine. I'll show you what I usually have in my backpack, what I've bought to fit in my new backpack and which items are a must-have. I think I just left space for like a, a random like clip, like an intro, like some kind of music illusion. Hi, my name is Jody, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Throughout my journey, I've met some pretty interesting people, done crazy things, had heartbreaks, met the love of my life, laughed until I cried, traveled to over 64 countries, learned some pretty hard lessons. I've loved hard, lost one, and then some. I'm a daughter, mother, wife, sister, best friend, costume designer, preschool teacher, senior food awards judge, observer style woman of the year awardee, secretary, television host, socialite, makeup artist, sales rep, model, and now YouTuber. Join me as I talk about everything from motherhood to makeup, style, lifestyle, and just about everything in between. Come along with me as I show you a glimpse into my crazy, hectic life. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Jody. Anyway, okay. Na, 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 and we're back. Okay, so this is my old backpack and it's actually not even mine. So I bought it for Levi and when it came, I was pleasantly surprised. I got this on Amazon and it's leather. It has a really easy <laughs> zipper, a pocket in the front and Nana fixed it for him so that the straps would be his size and really and truly, I can't expand this. So swinging the straps on my back are really hard and I decided, you know, I save all like my nice handbags and backpacks for when I travel. I'm not traveling right now and I'm like, why don't I use like a nice backpack? Why don't I get myself a nice backpack that I can use every day? I don't need to wait to travel or to be in foreign to use my nice stuff. So that was an excuse to buy a new backpack. Um, and yeah. Okay, so the backpack I decided to get, thanks to my aunt going away, I got the Louis Vuitton Missouri backpack and this is in the cover color Turtle Dove. Um, this is a limited edition, I don't know if it's a limited, no it's not a limited edition bag, it's a limited edition color. So I figure I already have a lot of black bags, um, I didn't want, the other color came in so it's black, turtle dove and like a cream color and I figured the cream would get a little bit too dirty I'm um, wearing every day so I got this co this color I prefer a backpack over a handbag just simply because I can swing it on my back and then I have my two hands free to look after the kids to do whatever um, yeah I like this one because the whole snap with the buckle comes loose so I don't have to be fiddling and because my backpack yo all the time people are like miss the backpack is open so I figure the magnetic closure is great. There we go. And it has a drawstring here. And I have the price. Okay then, I have a little pocket inside and inside is this really beautiful baby pink color. So in watching my other videos of what people pack in their handbag, a young lady was saying that for Louis Vuitton and I think for other designer bags, they have these amazing um, organizers. So this website is called Zumuni and you type into Zumuni the type of bag that you have and then it will come up with the organizer that best fits your bag. It had a wide range of colors and I selected baby pink and Pepto Bismol pink came. So I'm really, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not impressed at all with the color. I think the color is absolutely horrible. This is not a baby pink. Um, yeah, I mean, it was, it was $50 and it's felt, it seems to have like some good structure to it. I've had bad bag organizers in the past that are a little more flimsy. What the hell is that? They made a little pouch for the tag. I mean, you could cut like a $5 off for Zamuni because I don't need that. 
Um, there's a letter in here, probably my receipt saying thanks for buying me. Thank you. You know, honestly, like I just don't find that this color is baby pink. And I'm really upset about that. Anyway, it has some pockets and stuff that we are gonna fill now with my um, Louis Vuitton Montezui bag. All right, so I'm not gonna pack the bag. Actually, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Let me put rest this bag to the side. Rest the bag to the side. Now let me show you what I have in my backpack that I need every day. I have my wallet. This wallet has served me well. I think I've had this now for um, easily seven years. The zip is easy to open. I have all my credit cards. I don't have a lot of cash because I use my cards a lot. So I got my purse. This cute little thing I got when, I'm, when I was pregnant with Levi, it just opens out into a shopping bag. In Jamaica, we have a ban on plastic bags. So this is my reusable bag. If I go into the pharmacy, I need something. Um, wet ones, of course, I have these in my gym bag, in my handbag. Then this little bag here, this little pouch, my cousin made this for me and I was really impressed with her skills because this is a very small bag to, to sew. And what I put in it was, you know when you get those little emergency kits and it has like the nail file, the breath mints, the hair clips. Well, a friend gave me one for Christmas, but it was glitter and the glitter would always shed in my bag. So I just took out everything out of there and put in this. So I have Panadol, I have safety pins, I have a nail file, I have, this is broken. I think this is perfume. What is this? What is this? Oh yeah, perfume and it's empty. All right, that's coming out. A hair tie, um, shout wipes, and a sewing kit. There's a sewing kit in here. Okay, the next thing I have is, this is my phone charger. Now this phone charger, this is by Jackery. This one is really cool because I don't need to walk with that extra wire. So here we go. And I just plug this into my phone. The wire is like attached into this. And then on the other side, it has for, I think this is an um, Android phone. So it has my iPhone and I think there's, there's a light on it too, but I can't figure out how to make the light work. But this is really cool. So I always make sure that's charged up. I have Lysol in here, but it's broken. And then this I got the other day because I'm just so extra. So you know, nowadays you have to line up yeah, the lines are usually really long and sometimes they make you line up outside. I just back out my fan. And also, I have this because even in my diaper bag, I have a fan. I just don't like when my kitties are hot and sweaty. So I just have my fan, just, you know, fan myself. Don't know what that is. Okay. In the front pocket of this bag, I have a lotion. That's a must have. I have a couple lip glosses. I'm gonna go through and pick which one I want because I have a, quite a few hairs. So I have Vaseline, I have these three that deposit slight color. Don't need to have so many in my bag. Oh, I need to start wearing this. This is a posture corrector, so it has um, double-sided tape on the back and I stick it on my back and it's a, there's an app. I actually should be wearing it right now because it will help me with my posture and my diastasis recti. But anyway, so that's why my belly looks big if you can see all the way down there. So yeah, my posture corrector has an app and oh, um, when I start to slouch, it will just buzz and remind me to sit up straight. Oh, these saved me. So these are my Mood Lift CBD Mints. So, you know, if I just feel a little anxious about things, if I, you know, I'm being stressed out or if things aren't going the way I'd like them to go because I'm a bit of a perfectionist, I'll just pop two of these and I just kind of feel a little bit more relaxed and these have been amazing. The CBD mints. Next up, I have a little roller ball of perfume. This is just, I think this is a free one. I have must, okay, this is a must have in my bag. I actually, I believe I have one in my baby bag too. It's a tape measure. So I'm very involved with the fixing of the things in my house and I love a DIY. So if I'm going shopping or if I see something, I'm like, oh, how much is that? Like, how does it measure? Can it fit? Okay, let me measure it, then I'll go home. And I'm just surprised at how often I use a tape measure. So yeah, and the key I have here is, um, I think for Tracy's apartment. <laughs> so yeah, gotta have my tape measure. I have my AirPod Buds. 
I just really started using these. Sean gave these to me for my birthday, November gone, and I'm not really a very techie person, but I did charge them up the other night and I was using them, and they are pretty cool. So I keep them in my bag so that I can... Um... Shh, that's for me. Shh, just be still. Don't move. Push it. She can hear me, you know. It's like she can sense when I'm doing something. Okay. Yeah, so my earbuds. And I find that if I keep them in my bag, then I will be inclined to use them more. Um, two little packets of Splendor. So that's what I keep all the time in my handbag. So then I went onto YouTube and I was like, okay, what do other people keep in their handbags? What do I need to get? Um, you know, let me up my handbag game. Um, and then because I got my, or one, a pen, very important. Um, because I got the organizer, I'll be able to not only fit more, but you know, keep it more organized so that I can reach easily for whatever I need. And I do find that the bigger my handbag is the more things I put in there. So I'm gonna try pack all of this up and then, then I'll see like what I need to take out, what's not necessary. Okay, so this is just a case, um, a mask holder, and in it I have um, two or three black disposable masks. Um, I just keep extra masks on me, um, just in case like I'm going somewhere and I've left my um, reusable mask, or if I pick up somebody and we're going inside and they don't have their mask, or yeah, um, one time I saw a young man on the road and he didn't have a mask and they weren't letting him in. I pulled out my mask and I gave it to him. Um, he was outside the supermarket and he was trying to pull up. Anyway, whatever, I gave him a mask. I just walk with ex extra masks. Um, oh, I, I re-upped my shout wipes because I actually think the ones I have in my little sewing kit are um, dried out. So I just bought shout wipes. When you have kids, you need these. Wait, let me just re-fluff my hair. Fluff hair break. Mm, talk to me, nice. Um, I bought a small umbrella, it's been really rainy of late um, and while I will just run to my car because usually my, um, my gym towel's in and I'll dry off, I was like, you know what, let me get an umbrella. Um, you know I have two umbrellas in my car? This one is for my bag. Okay, so this is a little small umbrella. Then I got a pack of these, so it's just soap sheets, so I just slide it up. And, okay, more than one comes out, it's okay. The more soap, the better. So you just take, oh, there we go. Take out a sheet, and then you wet it, and you soap it up, lather it up, and it'll be soap. And I just thought that was really handy to have in my bag, um, because we need soap. This was something that um, another influencer had in, another influencer, like I'm one. <laughs> anyway, she had this in her bag, so I guess it's a bag clip. So I can, oh, and then hook it onto the table. So I'll leave a link in the description for all of this stuff. This is actually pretty cool. So you know how, and it just stays on the table like that, so your bag is not on the floor. There's a Jamaican saying, don't put your bag on the floor or you'll never have any money. And I, I really think that might be one of my problems. <sighs> anyway, so yes, it's really cool bag hook. What else do I have? So, um, I just, I need to stay off of YouTube. I find that when I go on YouTube and I search like certain videos, I, I buy stuff. So anyway, in looking at other people's, what do I have in my backpack? Somebody had this little, and it was so cute. Oh, hi, lip gloss. Um, it's really, really thick. And it smells nice, it smells like rose water actually. It's really thick, I guess, I guess it's okay. Don't recommend it. Very important, very, very important. This is actually a new bottle because I've been using this and I, so this is my Seriously Fab sunblock and it sprays like a mist. So hold on, this is, this is my new one. So because it sprays that nice fine mist, 
I'm more inclined to reapply throughout the day. And I have been reapplying. This is actually my, I think my fifth bottle in four months. Um, and I reached out to them and I have a discount code for you guys. Please, please, please guys. It's really, really important to reapply your sunblock and Seriously Fab makes it so easy. This one is unscented because they actually had a sale the other day and the little small bottles were, I think, 20 odd dollars. I have the big one in my, um, I, in my drawer in the, in the, what's that? Bathroom. So yeah, I'm always reapplying my sunblock and Seriously Fab made it so simple and they have great um, scents. So I'm um, just searching on Amazon and this case is really cool. It's all silicone. So I figured it would be really easy to keep clean. Like I could just wipe it off or wash it. And I thought that it was a really nice contrasting color. So I would be able to find it in my Pepto-Bismol pink organizer. Um, I'll leave the link below. I don't know what the brand is. It's just, it's just a no brand. Um, Clear eyes, this little eye drops. My These not, are not really for me. It's more for my sister. She has what I like to call leaky eye. Her eyes are always itchy and leaky and she always needs something. She, if she, her nose not leaking, her eye leaking, something wrong with her. So I'll just give her some eye drops to shut her up. So very important to have something in the back to shut up this stuff. Just over here. Next, I found this glass nail file. So I have natural nails. I wear my natural nails. So every now and then I'll get like a little snag or something. So I just walk with a nail file. And this one has a little case and it's a glass nail file. And that's what is really cool right now. And I really want to be cool. So I got it. Next up, I always walk with a couple of these in my bag. These are just the Crystal Light to go packages. So you just put this into a bottle of water. I actually have a really cool water bottle downstairs that I just got because I just find that I'm not having enough water in the days because I don't, I'm not a big water fan. So I'll just flavor my water with one of these, drop it in my water bottle and I'm more inclined to drink my water. A snack. So, um, I was on the core fit foods diet where it was no sugar, no carbs. And I would just keep a snack bar in my bag. And the snack, snack, the snack bars actually taste really, really good. Like I really like them. So I just have a snack bar in my handbag in case I get hungry, you stuck at the bank, you know, need to eat. And then, oh, oh great. My nail lady, um, Lisa, she's such a good businesswoman. So she's come out with these, it's like a cuticle pen and at the end, it, wow, it's a leak. It has um, a little brush so you can brush on cuticle oil. And especially now because everybody just spraying alcohol and sanitizer in your hand. You can keep your cuticles really nice and moisturized. And oh, then I just, actually, I got these quite some time ago, like two months, but I've never worn them. I bought, so I have the black ones. These are the black ones, these ones too, like $8 on Amazon. And I liked them so much that I was afraid I would lose them. So I went onto Amazon and bought the brown ones. So these are they. I really, really like them. And you know what? I find that I have like a designer bag. So people look at me and think these are the designer glasses. Oh my gosh, they match. Okay, I'm gonna tell everybody these are my new Louis V frames. They're custom. These are really nice. So yeah, I got the black ones and I was just afraid that, that I would lose them or even though I don't lose anything or they'd break or something and then I'd be out of glasses that I really like. So I bought the brown ones and I'm gonna start using them. I'm just leaving them in my bag. These are really nice. I leave a link in the description. They're like eight bucks. And you know what? I'm gonna get one of Sean's um, designer glasses cases and put them in, yeah. Yeah, my Louis P glasses. All right, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna load up my bag. So let me put my Pepto-Bismol pink organizer in and I'm going to put the small pockets to the, or wait, should I load this up and then put, let me see if this can even fit. Got this website with them, this baby pink. It's not baby pink. This is Pepto-Bismol pink, you lied to me. <laughs> 
All right, good fit, good fit, nice and snug. Oh. This is a little bit bigger than my Captain America bag. Levi can finally get back his bag. He, he, he used to get so confused. Mommy, that's my bag. I'm like, not anymore. Okay, all right. It's a nice organizer. And because it's felt, it has some structure to it. Um, then if it was just like fabric -y. all right. I feel a little stressed. Like I want, to, I want to have the perfect pack. I want everything to have its own place. As I say to my children, everything has a home. You have to put it away. I just feel a little stressed right now. All right, maybe what I will do is I'll make this for like all of the little cosmetic makeup -y things. There's still a tape on the... I don't know, packing this on camera is giving me some anxiety right now. All right, all right, slow down. Okay, so, hmm. there's actually, you know what's really cool about this, the, the organizer, although it's Pepto-Bismol pink, so there's, there's a contrast, so I can see, that doesn't make no sense, of course there's a contrast, it's a different thing. Anyway, it has a water bottle, it has a loop inside, bro. See that? So if I have a water bottle, it's not just like down in my bag rolling around. It's actually a well thought out organizer. Is it worth $50? You have a pocket in the side there. I guess you can hold your um, iPad. And then there's a couple pockets inside. You have water. I've used a bag organizer in the past and um, I do like them because you can see where everything is. You don't have to be digging around too much. And the one that I had in the past, it wasn't made of like a, a, a structured material. So it was just like a fabric pocket. This one is really nice with the felt. It's sewn very nicely. It's made very nicely. $50. You know what? I'd have to answer that when I've used it a little bit to see the wear and tear. Um, see how easily it washes but it's made very nicely, it's sewn very nicely. You know, it, it has some nice structure to it. It's thought out nicely in terms of the, the water bottle holder. $50, I don't know, after spending a big money on the bag, do I really want to spend $50 on an organizer? I do like to be organized. All right, put the organizer back in the bag, make sure it fits snugly on the bottom. All right, so, I don't know, I don't know, I like, I, I don't know. This is like, I think I need to like, I don't know. All right, how do I do this? I just, is there sand or something? I think I'll put all of like the beauty things in here. So I have my nail file, my cuticle oil, this extra, um, what do you call it? I want it, well, I don't want to put the, the sunblock in there because I feel like I want to keep the sunblock really handy. Once it's handy, I'm going to use it. All right, so you get a front pocket. That is prime real estate in the bag, my people. All right, the wet ones, I'm going to put at a pocket at the back, easy to reach to, right? Because you got to lift it and open it and get, okay. And is there sand somewhere, right? What is this? Dandruff? What is this? It's this bag. Okay, let me leave you over here. Then I'll put the soap sheets in. The eye drops I'll put. The lotion I'll put. Okay, so this is filling up really fast. Um, what else do I have? Let me do... All right, the pen can have its own packet. Hi, Trey. Hi, what are you doing? I'm just filming for my YouTube. What are you feeling? That these are the shoes that you got me. Oh, those are nice. What's this? This is a what's in my backpack video. So I have a new backpack, so I'm showing everybody what I used to have on in well, my- Well, you remember when you were pregnant, you used to always have preparation H for your hands. No, I, that's not true. That's not true. <laughs> All right, so right in the front part where I'm gonna keep my phone, I'm gonna drop my pen in there just because I find that I'm always using my pen. 
Um, all right, next up now, my umbrella. I think I'm gonna put the umbrella in the water bottle space just because it has that nice looping. Um, back clip, I'm gonna take it out the box. This is actually really cool. What was the brand? Clipper. So it looks like a circle and then you open it and the rubber part here will grip onto the table. This is actually a really good idea. I'm glad I, I'm glad I bought that one. I'm going to put it in one of the back pockets here. So I'll forget about it, I never use it. Okay, then I have my disposable case. This is a nicer color pink than the, than the what was I doing? So I'm gonna put my disposable masks right at the back. You know, I think I'm gonna put the disposable masks and the wet ones together. Right. So back to my cosmetic packing, my soap, sheets. And you know what? I'm just gonna have two of these CBD mints. Now, this container is so cute. So it's only 10 milligrams, so I'm gonna pop two. But you, so it's not easy for kids. So you slide one little piece up, pop it off. Yeah, it doesn't taste like a milk. Huh? You know what? I think these things might be placebos. Hey, anyway. I put in my charger. I need to see how much charge. Do I need to charge this up? Oh no! And the charge in this Jackery stays for a really long time. Like I can't tell you. I think I charged this over about three weeks ago. Mmm, that pocket is um. Hmm, not sure about that pocket. My AirPods, I'm gonna put my AirPods at a, in the front pocket in prime real estate, prime real estate. And I think I'm gonna put my sewing kit in here as well, just because I'll know anything that I want to keep cosmetic-y is in this bag. This is a really nice bag. It's gonna be easy to wash, easy to dry. Put this in here. Do I need anything else in here? Oh, a little perfume I'll put in here as well. Oh, where's my purse? So I put my purse in the, the big section as well and I'll do that sticking up. I just find that no matter how big your bag is, you just always, it just always fills up. Okay, I just don't see the need for three lip glosses in my bag. So I'm gonna take my favorite and leave in here and I'll put in the same pocket as my Seriously fab block just simply because I'll be using that often. So I'm gonna put my crystal light drink mixes, my um sweeteners, and my snack bar. I'm gonna put them all in one pocket to keep them together. I'm gonna probably repack this bag 10 million times because I, I'm not sure if I'm happy about this. I'm not sure. My fan. Keep my kid is cool. Mm, not happy about that placement. Not happy about that placement. <sighs> this is, this is kind of stressful. My tape measure, I'm just gonna drop it in at the bottom somewhere. Do I feel happy about that? Do I feel happy about just dropping it in the bottom? How do you feel about that? Oh no, there's a pocket right here. All right, you know what? I'm gonna put it with the back clip. What else do I have? Oh, my... Oh no, I packed in the oh hi. I'm gonna leave this handy to at the front. You know, I think, I think. <sighs> bag anxiety, bag anxiety. Or maybe what I should do is pack everything in. You know when people do that, that overview video and you can see what they're packing?
so much things in the bag it can't close now. So this is my new backpack. It's all packed and ready for me to go on the road. Um, if when I put it on it feels a little heavy, I'd probably take out the umbrella and leave in the car. So that will be a third umbrella in my car. But anyway guys, that's what I have in my backpack. Thanks for joining me today on my YouTube. And um, I'll see you next week. Remember to click that like button, make sure you subscribe and drop a comment below what other videos you'd like to see or what am I leaving out of my handbag? What else do I, sorry, my backpack. What else do I need to pack in my backpack? Like, uh, did, I, did I miss out anything? I don't think so. I, 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 think I'm, I think I'm solid. If you need anything, like I got you covered. I have a sewing kit in here, okay? Bye guys, thanks for watching. Hey!